Yeah, so today I just want to go shortly over this uh, DMD2 app from Talk Racing. I have it running on a Samsung Active 2 tablet. Uh, you can buy them now for about a hundred dollars. They're waterproof, dustproof, and some sort of shockproof military grade. Uh, mounted it on a cheap plastic uh, tablet mount. If that thing breaks, uh, I'm not too worried about it. I think it was like $40. And then uh, in the front, I got this um, one inch ball setup, ram mount style kind of, and uh, works really good for me. Went through a lot of potholes already and does move. And what you can actually do, I think it's a very good uh, alternative to Garmin, Magellan, you name it. I think it's actually better, but that's just my opinion, because you're kind of flexible. You can load whatever, whatever app you like for navigation, uh, offline maps, OSM and or maps, Google Maps or Locus Map. Uh, you can just basically load those applications into here as shortcuts, those little things here, they're usually plus signs and you basically can put the shortcuts in there. Up here it shows you how your GPS reception is. Uh, and right now they do have also an in-app navigation, but I think it doesn't, it's not point to point. You can uh, import GPX files here. Um, and uh, here you load your apps as into the shortcuts. Shop to support. As you can see, I use my gloves. You can use this with gloves. Uh, settings for brightness. Shop for support. Uh, global settings, 24 hours uh, setting Fahrenheit, Celsius, and so on. For those who do rally, they have even a roadbook in here. Pretty cool. OBD2, if you have a USB dongle, um, sorry, a Bluetooth dongle, you can connect that to your uh, to your OBD2 and read out the uh, engine info like, you know, RPMs, water temperature, and so on. And uh, here you have like a regular dashboard. And here you go back to the home. And you can personalize it a little bit with your name and a logo or whatever you want to do. And all this is very customizable. So you can open Locus Maps. You know, it opens your off off offline map. Very easy. Very easy to use, very easy to set up. And 100 bucks for the tablet. 40 maybe for that tablet holder and another 20 for the or 25 for the ball joints in the back the holders and mounts and so on and you all set and if you don't even want to spend the 99 bucks and you it happened you have like a a used uh, android phone sitting around then you just use that works fine it doesn't need a lot of um CPU or anything like that to operate. I think if that phone is not older than two years, two, three years, you'll be perfectly fine. And that's what actually it did in the beginning. I used the old uh, Android phone that I had sitting around just to see how I like it. And then I decided to actually in, get me a little bit bigger, bigger screen, easier to read the map and, uh, and done. So DMD2. From Talk Racing, I'm considering to donate a little bit into their shop. Uh, it's really a great app. Um, probably not a lot of people know about it. I don't know, but uh, that's why I make the video. Well, my Photoshop is not that big, but that's why you gotta subscribe and uh, grow my channel, of course. Have a good day. Next time. Thank <laughs> you.